This is WCPO 9 News. Thank you for joining us. I'm Julie O'Neill. Here's a look at some of the day's top stories. Hundreds have turned out to pray the steps at Holy Cross Immaculata Parish in Mount Adams. Last year's ceremony was called off due to the pandemic. The Archdiocese of Cincinnati says social distancing is in place this year and masks are required. Big crowds at the Dora at the banks during yesterday's opening day festivities, getting some unwanted attention from Ohio Governor Mike DeWine. He's expressed concern about people not wearing masks, calling the pictures and video troubling, saying he would not let his family near there. Amtrak is planning to roll out a major expansion of its passenger rail service, including more trains in and out of Union Terminal. The proposal under President Biden's infrastructure plan would add a new train line linking Cincinnati, Columbus and Cleveland. We will learn more today about the effort to save a historic Catholic church in Evanston and turn it into a community center. The MARC Board of Directors is hosting a presentation later today detailing their efforts to save St. Mark Church on Montgomery Road. Jennifer. The tri-state under a freeze warning again today. We will basically see those temperatures below the freezing mark until 11 a.m. And then we're warming back to the mid to upper 40s this afternoon. That plus sunshine will feel so much better than what we dealt with yesterday. So good to see that. And the way things are shaping up tonight, it will be chilly again, down to 29 degrees. It's a clear sky, south wind at about 3 to 8 miles per hour. So, I mean, we are going to deal with the chill, but over the weekend, we're coming out of it. Back to 60 on, on Saturday, the mid 60s on Sunday. That's just in time for Easter. Great for Easter egg hunts, lunch with the family. Whatever it is you're doing, it will not be bitterly cold over the weekend. And this continues next week.